How's it going guys? And welcome back for another video. Today's video is somewhat different. If you've been around the channel for a while, you will know sometimes I do these type of canon releases. And of course, for everyone that just joined your channel, thank you guys so much for the support. But anyways, let's go ahead and dig straight into it. Today, we are going to release a canon made by Dalabi and Saps. This canon right here is designed to be very easy and quick to print. It comes in both three seconds and a four second clock, and is mainly used as a counter cannon to get rid of other cannons. It has a range of 48 chunks and it can float 40 blocks. You build the platform at Y210 and it requires an east to west patch which is probably on every single faction server out there. But alright, that was just some small details about the cannon. Taking a quick look at the cannon, you can see how small it is and how easy it is to print. If your server modified it so printer is actually pretty good, this right here would take absolutely no time to print it. And when it comes to the 3 and 4 seconds, that is in insane it even nukes all the way down to y40 or something like that but all right guys let's go ahead and dig straight into it as you can see the barrel is already set up let me just quickly go ahead and show you guys how you set that up straight above the staircase you build a block so that's the y that's the height of the shot so of course you want to place that block to where the height is you want to shoot then the way it's set up right now we are adjusting this way so you're going to need a block that way as well and then it's going to slide off that one and hit the wall if you have any questions about setting up this cannon this way let me know down the comments now try to explain it as good as i can but let's just dig straight into it the button press is down here you, you can either use the level or you can use the button in our case i'm just gonna go ahead and flick the level and we should be seeing it going crazy right now so as i said it's a 255 it nukes efficient nukes and of course it nukes all the way down to i would say about y48 ish the cannon we're shooting right now is a three second cannon but it does come with a four second clock as well in case that you kind of want to do that instead it also comes as a water schematic as well. So everybody that doesn't know how to water it properly, there will be a schematic down below where you can easily water it as well. Now that you have seen that the cannon works perfectly, of course the TPS did drop a tiny bit right here, 12 TPS. Let's go ahead and turn it off. Let's go ahead and go a little bit more into details where everything is. The part you see right here is the power. The power is then boosted by this right here and that right there, but that's no biggie. Over here you see the hammer and underneath the hammer you have the hammer for the nuke as well down here now over here we have the nuke that is the last part of the three parts right here and as you can see this right here is the nuke and of course that is getting boosted by all of this as well if you go to the front you can see that this is where the sand comp is placed if you take a quick look inside you can see that the sand compression is made in a way that makes it very very compact the sand is getting boosted by these boosters and of course getting boosted over here where these right here were boosted over here and then the nuke and the what's it called the sand is getting pushed by these boosters over to the barrel as you see over here now there is a way you can 360 with this cannon here as well but it does not really do it that far so for right now let's go ahead and leave it as it is right now and just shoot forward in case you want to disable the nuke for some reason you can do that right here by just taking that redstone out and the nuke is now disabled if you want to disable the slap boss you can do that easily up here this right here marks the slap boss this all here is the slap boss so all you got to do is just go ahead and disable this piston and you should be good to go in the middle of the cannon you can see this is where we are going to have our red sand it does have a storage of red sand as well so you don't have to refill it all the time and of course that goes down to right here and getting pushed out along with the hammer and i'm pretty sure that's everything you need to know about this cannon if you want to download this cannon right here all you have to do is join my discord server and find the channel quick print along with this cannon and along with some other cannons will be down in there free to download you can just go ahead and download it and use it and yeah that is pretty much it hopefully you guys enjoyed this video here and if you did make sure you smash that like button and comment down below if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do that right now. Join your daily dose of Dexter. Other than that, hopefully you guys are having a fantastic day. And I'll see you guys next time.